Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create a simple pendulum 3D animation simulations by using Blender 4.2. So start from now, I'm going to show you all the step by step how to make a simple pendulum with 100% accuracy. So first I'm going to just save this and just create a fresh new 3D project and show you from beginning. First click the empty area, press A and press delete button to delete everything. Next we are going to add a circle, add a mesh, add a circle and then we are going to create an empty plane as this, then just press S and move it to negative 1 here. It will be here and we are going to attach this to the circle. So click the MT, hold the shift, click the circle, control P to bind this MT to the circle and name this MT as circular motions reference. Alright. Then next we are going to make a rotation for this circle. Whenever you rotate it, you can see the MT will rotate together at Z axis. So now we are going to just type hash frame slash, for example, 30. Now if you try to play, now you can see it rotate. This is a constant circular motion of this MT. It is going to, to turn around this circle. So, we are going to just make this smaller. This is just a reference play. Right, it is really simple. Alright, next, at here, we are going to create another reference. Just add another empty. Plan as this. Just press S to just make it smaller. This one we are going to name this as locations reference. This is actually it's called oscillations. We just name this as oscillation reference. And for this oscillation reference, we are going to just make it move along the X axis, something like this. So the location X back to the zero. The location X, we are going to add a driver and move it up, move your mouse cursor to here, drag it down. When you see a cross, then you just drag it down at here, search for driver. For this driver, we are going to make the, circu the circular motion reference as the driver. So click the X location, choose the driver. Now, scroll down the object we have to choose, the circular motion reference. And the reference is the X location. It's only for the X locations. Now we try to play. You can see this is an oscillation that oscillates along the X axis. And we may want to make the speed faster. So we click the circle again to make this faster. Just make it frame slash 10. Press enter. Now it is going to oscillate faster in this way. To just look it clearer, you can see this oscillation reference, it is going to take the locations of the X of the circular motion reference. Now this is a simple harmonic motion. This is an oscillation. Now the final step, we are going to create the 3D model of the pendulum. First just add, add a mesh, add a cylinder, then just press S make it small and make it as a stick so 
scale it again, make it as a stick. Alright, next we are going to attach a attach a ball at the bottom. Just add a mesh, add a add a UV sphere. Just press S to just make it small and move it down. Click the ball, hold the shift, click the stick, and then just just right click. Sorry. Click the ball, hold the shift, click the stick, control P to just attach the pendulum. This one is a pendulum on the stick. Pendulum stick, something like this. Alright. For the pendulums for the pendulum stick, we may want to just move the pivot point. Just press control, full stop, and drag the pivot point to somewhere here. And control, full stop again, then move the ball down. Now, this one, the pivot point is at, at the top here. Now, if you try to just rotate it, then it, it will behave like a pendulum. So control Z first. Next, we are going to just move it up, something like this, and then we are going to just make the stick to face face on the oscillation reference. So click and create a constraint, add object constraint, just track to choose the object, choose the oscillation reference. Now. It will always face to there. Now try to play. You can see this, a simple pendulum already created. Just by using all the drivers. A simple pendulum is created. The final stage we are going to just create the material. Maybe you can just put a base color. Turn on the texture. Create a base color blue now try to play if you click the minus y you can see it, it really behave as a simple pendulum and the theory is because of the oscillation reference it take the circular motions the x the x component of the circular motions and it is going to oscillate at here and the pendulum always face to the oscillation reference and track to the oscillation reference so now a simple pendulum already created and you can put it on your 3d model like the analog clocks to just make a very simple pendulum in this way all right that's all for today about my tutorials on how to make a simple pendulum 3d animation simulations just by using the driver in Blender 4.2 to make it a 100% accurate simple pendulum where you can control the speed of the circular motion. Once you control the speed of the circular motion, it is going to control the oscillation speed of the simple pendulum. All right, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials, and sharings, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animations and 3D game developing. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that, so that when it's time I publish a new video, tutorials or sharings, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animations and 3D game developing. See you!